Andragogy is the art and science of adult learning. It is a concept developed by Malcolm Knowles, who thought the concept of pedagogy, which focuses on methods for teaching children, did not sufficiently explain the unique ways in which adults learn. So, Knowles developed six principles of andragogy. The first principle is self-concept. Self-concept refers to the fact that people's self-perception as a learner shifts as they transition from youth into adulthood. Children often rely heavily on adults to learn. Adults, on the other hand, tend to identify themselves as being responsible for their own learning. So, Knowles argued that teachers should respect that adults want to engage in self-directed learning. The second principle is experience. From Knowles' perspective, adults carry with them a wide range of life experiences, far more than children, simply due to the fact they've been around for longer. As a result, adult classrooms need to embrace the experiences that the students bring to the classroom. Strategies can include using seminar discussions to share how our experiences intersect with the learning materials, applying our thoughts to real-life case studies, and integrating a diversity of students' experiences into a classroom. The third principle is readiness to learn. Knowles argues that adult learners often demonstrate readiness to learn when they identify a need in their lives that learning will help satisfy. In other words, we adults will be motivated, learn when we see a clear and immediate application for the knowledge we're pursuing. The fourth principle is orientation to learning. Adult learners are often problem-oriented rather than subject-oriented when it comes to learning. As a result, lessons should not be structured like high school, where students jump from subject to subject. Lessons should be structured around solving a problem, not a subject like physics or English. Knowles' fifth principle is motivation to learn. Adults are mainly motivated to learn by internal factors such as self-esteem, curiosity, desire to achieve, and satisfaction. External motivators like promotions, salary increment or career advancement, while influential, often rank lower in driving motivation, according to Knowles. So, teachers need to create course material that fuels adults' curiosity and passions in order to motivate them. Finally, the sixth principle is the need to know. The need-to-know principle states that adults need to understand why they should learn something before undertaking the learning process. For instance, let's consider a situation where an adult is asked to attend a machine learning workshop. The adult's first instinct might be to inquire about why they should invest their time and energy learning this specific area. They need to be convinced about why they need to know the topic before they engage in learning. So, in designing educational programs for adults, it's crucial that the instructional design includes an explanation of why the material is important. If you're writing an essay on andragogy, I'd recommend reading my article on this topic on my website, where I present some critiques of the concept. Providing some criticism of these six principles can help add depth and insight into your essays. A link to the article is provided in the pinned comment, or... You can click on the video on the screen now to watch my video on pedagogy, which refers to the art of teaching children.